Good morning, I'm Michelle Heron with your local 3 News Fastcast. Give us one minute and we'll tell you what's happening. Cleanup continued overnight on MLK and Riverfront Parkway after a chemical spill last night. The leak forced evacuations in the area, but those have since been lifted. Several businesses in the area remained closed for the cleanup and traffic was diverted from the roadway. Around 1,600 people in Gaza and Israel have died in the attacks and counteroffensive, including at least 11 Americans, including nearly 200,000 people that have been displaced in Gaza since Israel began its retaliation. President Joe Biden says it's not yet clear how many U.S. citizens are missing and some Americans may be among those being held by Hamas. The GBI is investigating a deadly officer-involved shooting at a home in Walker County. Deputies responded to a domestic call Sunday and found that the suspect had a warrant from Whitfield County. There was an exchange of gunfire after deputies entered the home. The suspect died and a deputy was injured. Take the news with you inside our app and check back with us throughout the day. I'm Michelle Heron. That's your Fastcast News in one minute.